this, this, this. Do you, do you, do you, did you ever see people like almost like taking advantage of you, maybe like trying to pay you less or, or like say like kind of like dismiss you just because you're small? Like, it, I, don't, I don't know. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll always have in the back of my mind, like, you know, you, you, no wrestler blames himself, but you sometimes you think, well, that's why they won't put me in this position because I'm sure, mm. or that's why they won't put me in this position because of this. I mean, you've only got yourself to blame a lot of the time. Maybe it's the way I carry myself. I don't know. But like, yeah, but it, yes. With money, it's like, I, I've never had an issue with money. I, I, I'm the one, one of them people that doesn't, people will tell you me till the cows come home. Oh, you this, you this, you this. But I, I'm one of them ones that probably don't value myself enough. But as I've got older, I have and been more really strict with it now. Um, compared to how I used to be when I was a lot younger when you'd met me. Mm -hmm. 20 pounds, no problem. Mm -hmm. Go to the end of the bloody country, yeah, but no you sleep. You have to do that. That's, I, yeah. Less as a small person and more as a young yeah, person. Yeah, yeah. It, it, was, it was never about the money. Right. It was about, and I think you touched on it when you did that punk podcast all that time ago. That was wrestling, getting in a car with your mates, traveling for hours and hours, enjoying the ride and getting there and having the best time doing mm. what you loved and traveling home, sometimes sore, having a laugh about what you saw. And going home and back to work on Monday, and it's not a, it's not a, and God, it's the worst. Where these young wrestlers are like, how do I get to WWE? Yeah, and it's and if if you live like that, you're not living. It should just be like I'm gonna have, maybe you know, like I'm hoping for four months worth of bookings to yeah. just have the sweetest time ever, I and hope these bookings continue. I don't think anyone really thinks about. I, I think the ones that really do well. Uh, like you, like, like yourself. I mean, it never entered in my head going to WWE. It entered in my head. I want to be a wrestler. This journey just seems to keep going. Yeah, yeah. Let's just roll with it. See what happens. Right. Although at the same time, though, it's just like. So I'll, I'll say it like, um, you know, like some of the smartest people have a five year plan. <laughs> like, yeah, you I know. know. Did you have a five year plan? No, but um, who's the comedian? Um, Jimmy Carr, you know Jimmy yeah, Carr? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Brendan Burns, who uh, I did the comedy show in Edinburgh with, he was telling me how, like, Jimmy Carr had a, uh, he had um, a corporate job and then entered comedy. It was like, he had a five-year plan and then he fucking did it and now he's a millionaire. And, like, I was like, God, I guess that makes so much sense. It does. If I, you hit it, like, a business-wise. I'll tell, tell you, I may have slightly lied there because I said to myself, if I, if I don't get anywhere when I'm 30, I was going to jack it in. You're gonna. I'm sorry. What? I, I, when I, I as was gonna jack, jack it, as opposed to jack it off. Not to jack it off. Jack it in. That's it. That's an. That's an English one as well. Jack it in. Like, I, like I. I, I, can't I mean, I got the context. You know what I mean? It sounded funny. Yeah. The reverse. Jack that's a reverse off. jizz. Yeah. A reverse crank. <laughs> it's, um, that's when you turn your hand and pretend yeah. it's like the other person. Or sit on it forever. Someone else. There's so many names. Um. So I decided that if I'm 30, I'll probably think about winding it down and mm. concentrate on my day-to-day -day job because I was at the bank, but I never actually progressed well in my bank career because all I was thinking about was wrestling. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing payments and messing up because I'm thinking about, oh, I've got to design my ring attire. I've got to do this, right. I've got to do that. What am I going to do the weekend? What match am I going to do? So at 30, I was going to jack it in. And then <laughs> British Boot Camp just literally landed in my lap Whoa. Um, in the August of my 29th year. Oh, fuck. And, and then got signed in the October. It aired in January. And then it was my 30th birthday on 30th of January of uh, 2013. Uh, was it 2013, sorry? And then I was flying to America on the 3rd of February and this new life started at 30. Mm. Life begins at 30. That's crazy. For, for James in that sense. but uh, Because I'll, I'll share my story and then I have a question. Like I was the same way. Uh, I remember being 23 and teaching at the school and then also wrestling. I graduated and then I had to get like a shitty job to support my wrestling habit, as Tracy Smothers would say. And uh, I was teaching and I was like, well... I'm going to still do this. And when I'm 30, if nothing's happened for me, I'm going to go get my teaching degree and become a full-time teacher. And then, you know, I signed it with WWE at 27. That kind of all went out the window. Um, but so it was the bank. So I did have something like that. Was the bank, um, was that something that you saw people move up? Is that a job where like you could have moved up to be like the CEO of the bank or something or no? no or would, would you have been a teller for life kind of have, thing? You'd have been a teller, but you'd be a grade one going to a two, to a three, two, okay. but you're still a teller. Or maybe, wow, a team leader. Or maybe an op <laughs> operations manager. You never saw that as a full-time, like... Not that I... W or you did after it 30. Was, it was my full-time job, but after 30, I was like, I've got to get a house, I've got to save, I've got to save, I've got to save. So and what was the plan? Like, just move up in the bank? Just focus on that more tell them I want to 
sort this out because I was doing well at uh, Barclays that I was at. Mm. I just started there like a couple of years before, and I was I was getting bonuses for the first time. It was the first time in my life I think I was actually doing really well at my day job as well as wrestling. So I was enjoying myself. I was enjoying life. It was really good. And then it landed in my lap. I, I don't know. You don't know if there's a plan out there for you or stuff, mm. but I'm like, things kind of happened then. It was really cool. It was just Hey guys, this week's show is brought to you in part by Bomba Socks, the most comfortable quality, best fitting socks on the market. It's the socks I wear every single day. I wear them to wrestling shows. I wear them under my wrestling boots. When I buy a pair, when you buy a pair, they donate a pair to someone in need. Do something great. Go to B-O-M-B-A-S dot com slash Colt. If you do, they'll give you 20% off your first order. And if you don't like them, just return them. No questions asked. Go enjoy yourself some new Bomba Socks. But for now, Enjoy the show. This is the art of wrestling. With Brought to you by 54 Club and 54 Club.com. It's a club, it's kind of a click. They're sending you sweet clothes that you get to wear out of Los Angeles once a month. You can't get these clothes in store. 54 is an actual brand itself. You gotta be a member if you want to look this good. Listen, there's only so many times in my life I can wear a free wrestling t-shirt and the same sweatpants that I bought for 10 pounds at the Fringe Festival in 2013. I do wear them a lot. I got to get out of this habit. And I know you're probably the same way or maybe your husband or your boyfriend. And if you do have a clothes budget, then this is for you. 5-4 Club is 60 bucks and free shipping. Each club delivery, they send you sweet clothes that are hip and fit your fashion sense. My fashion sense, I picked casual, but they also got classic, forward, and mix. It's the perfect way to build up your wardrobe. You can have options, different season, different looks, and you don't have to go shopping around. They just send it to you. 54club.com. If you dig it, sign up. Use the promo code Colt. Get 50% off your first month. That's 30 bucks your first month. Go to 54club.com. Use that code Colt. Get 50% off. Start looking good. 